Back inside the 680 Fan Cave here in our air-conditioned studios, we did our game day rundown yesterday on the field, and it was just way too hot, so I figured I would let my trusty assistant, Caitlin, have some nice air conditioning here and do our game day rundown from the studios here at the Battery Atlanta. We're getting you set for the Braves and the Mets. It's game number two of their three-game set coming up tonight at 7.20 p.m. Eastern. Braves enter play tonight at tying their high watermark on the season. They are 71 and 50, 21 games over 500. The lead over the Nationals here in the division is now six and it is now nine over both the Phillies and the New York Mets. Mets enter tonight 61 and 58, but they have struggled on the road away from City Field this season. Ten games under 500. They are 27 and 37 on the season. Let's look back at last night, a five to three win for the Braves in game number one of this series against uh, a team that had been red hot. The Mets entered play last night, winners of 15 of their last 17 ball games. Ronald Acuna Jr., homer number 34 for him last night as he inches closer and closer to some tremendous career career milestones here six more homers and 12 stolen bases that would give him 40 40 and that would be one heck of a sophomore campaign for the reigning national league rookie of the year josh donaldson three for four on the night for him last night he has hit safely in 16 of his last 21 games and max freed improving to 14 and four in last night's ball game one earned over six innings of work he now has a sub four era on the season. Uh, Ronald Acuna Jr., let's talk about his August for just a moment. 12 games in the month of August, nine home runs already. Now, if you factor in last August, he has 20 homers in the month of August. That by far is the most in all of Major League Baseball over the last two seasons. Braves give the ball to Dallas Keuchel here tonight. Keuchel 3-5 and five with a 483 in 10 starts with the Braves here this season. Coming off his worst outing in a Braves uniform, that was against the Marlins on the most recent road trip. He lasted just three and two-thirds innings, responsible for eight earned runs on 10 hits he gave up three homers in that start so Keiko looking for a bounce back performance here tonight focused on making quality pitches early in the at bat we talked to him yesterday for a couple of minutes and he said with this heat and this humidity important for him to try to get quick outs. so look for him to be aggressive and on the attack early in the count here tonight against the New York Mets Mets will counter with the 28 year old lefty Steven Matz here tonight Matz is seven and seven with a 449 ERA in 23 appearances 21 starts with the Mets here this season June 9th 19th, he faced the Braves right here at SunTrust Park. He gave up five earned over five innings of work, gave up a couple of home runs to Austin Riley and Ozzy Albies in that contest. He is just two and seven, though, on the road, an ERA approaching seven uh, in 12 road starts for Steven Matz here this season. So it'll be a couple of lefties here tonight, Dallas Keuchel and Steven Matz game two of three. It'll be another steamy night here at the ballpark. So hopefully, if you're coming down, stay hydrated. If you're not coming to the ballpark, uh, Ben Ingram and Jim Powell will have you covered right here on 680 The Fan and the Atlanta Braves. Radio Network. Also, big props to Caitlin behind the scenes. She just said I do over the weekend. So, Caitlin getting married. Congratulations to her. She's showing off the rock. So, make sure you're following her right now. She's uh, probably putting it on her Instagram story. So, again, it's the Braves and Mets game two and three here tonight at 7.20 p.m. Eastern right here at SunTrust Park.